Hey, what's up everybody? It's Dallas with Gadget Hacks, and today I'm going to show you how to get stock lollipop sounds and ringtones on custom ROMs for the Nexus 6. Now most custom ROMs like Cyanogen or Paranoid Android are based on AOSP, and while the stock ROM for the Nexus 6 shares that base, Google puts a lot of little proprietary tweaks on top of it. For one, they've updated all of the ringtones and notification sounds to fit better with material design, and they all sound a lot more mature and polished. But since these changes didn't get merged with AOSP, custom ROMs are still using the old KitKat sounds. Some ROMs, like Cyanogenmod here, throw a lot of extra ringtones in the mix, but they still don't have the updated Lollipop versions. So developer Bahasur made a flashable zip that'll give you the newer sound files on any custom ROM. Think of this like another extra zip to flash when installing a custom ROM. You've got your G apps, Super SU, a custom kernel maybe, and now this. And if you've already flashed your custom ROM like I have, everything will work just the same if you flash the zip on top of it. So let me boot into custom recovery, and I'll show you how the install process works. You're obviously already familiar with this interface if you're running a custom ROM, so I won't bother you with technical details. Just tap install, then navigate to your download folder, and select the 5.0 sounds.zip file. This would be the same if you're coming off a fresh ROM install, or say if you hit the add more zips button after installing the ROM and GApps. But anyway, just swipe the slider at the bottom of the screen to install the mod, and when that's finished, tap Reboot System. When you get back up, you'll find the updated ringtones added to the stock ringtone picker. They have the same names that they used on KitKat or ICS, but they've just been refreshed, like Callisto here. That mature sound really meshes well with the new material design look, in my opinion. But for more tips and tricks like this, be sure to check out my article at the link in the description below. And as always, we'd appreciate it if you would like and comment on this video and subscribe to our channel. So we'll see you again next time, folks. But until then, happy gadget hacking.